Hello everybody and welcome back, not just to the Mauer Power YouTube channel, which is uh, now coming off of a uh, several month hiatus, which I'm very excited about, uh, but also to another Hearthstone solo adventure. I am very excited to get League Good of Explorers timing, started adventure. here. Welcome to the Hall of Explorers. Let's see what this first wing has to offer us. We've got a lead on the three pieces of the Staff of Origination. Can you help us recover them? Uh, I sure hope so. Reserved for the... Huh. Interesting. I wonder why they didn't just... Not have a slot there. Because it looks right in this instance like it's supposed to replace... Where the fifth wing would have been for the... I don't know. A useless observation. Let's get our ticket stamped here. I don't know why we burned it. I would think we would, like, need to show it to someone to, uh, get on a plane somewhere. But, uh, no. Nah. I'm just rambling, making awful jokes. Let's see. Reno's inside already, and he needs your help. Ah, yes. Well, it would seem that the reward for this first week is, uh, yeah, Reno Jackson. Hmm. I don't know. I feel like there has to be a, a legitimate deck where... No. On second thought, no. You pretty much want... Any any good deck, you want two of at least some things. Just for consistency's sake. Yeah, I don't know. I don't see that being a whole lot of useful. Ancient Shade. Hmm. Not sure I like the look of that one either could die to most other four drops and you're randomly going to take seven damage oh well Reno's nearly to let's the stop world. uh critiquing the but cards and see what fights we've got in, in he store found. here draw a card give your opponent a wish interesting hmm all right let's see what kind of wishes we get Right now, uh, I'd say my favorite deck to play is my, uh, Dragon Lock, so let's see how that fares. I'm really excited for the, uh, I think he's Sir Finley Merlington. Like, uh, I think it's a one, one cost, one three Murloc that lets you discover a Murloc. For those who don't know, discover is a new mechanic whereby you get three cards of three random cards of a of a type in this case murloc and then you choose between them which one you would like to take um that sounds like honestly scary good i have a murloc shaman deck that i'm a fan of that i want to put that in oh hey new map of course i'm reno jackson world-renowned archaeologist explorer and treasure hunter. You don't say. With the self-control of a magpie. Yeah, I thought we already had an Indiana Jones, uh, kind of analog in here. I don't know why we get another one. Oh, hey, speaking of Discover. Oh. Speaking of crap. What? <laughs> Well, come on! <laughs> There's not a lot I can do against that! Ah, crap. Alright. Let's see what happens. Uh, it's nice that he's willing to grant wishes while he's trying to kill us! Yeah, that was a whole lot of fun. You would have been better last turn, significantly. I mean... Yeah, I want to play Imp Gang Boss, but I can't let this get out of hand. Uh, let's discover a four-cost card. Think Mechanical Yeti will serve us best here. And then, do we have room for two more wishes? Yes, we do. We'll have exactly ten cards after we do wow. this turn. I can't believe that worked! Oh, but he's gonna give us another wish! Ah, crap. Forgot about that. Let's discover a minion. Hmm. Let's actually go with Shield Bear. We've already taken Your too much damage. Uh, I've gotta, gotta do something about that. And finally... I mean, ugh. None of these are really that helpful. I guess Demon Heart. Job's done. Alright. Let's see what other nonsense he's got. 
like that. Awesome. Alright, so, so I tell you about the time I infiltrated the ogres of Dyer Okay, Mall I do not need the constant yes. commentary. That's getting a little old. Let's put that up. You can probably kill it this turn. Um at least it'll stop the whirling zap from giving us a whole ton of damage though. Oh, is that a new card back that we can get? That would be cool. Well, how about sneaking through the Ah, did I just burn a Twilight Drake? Yes. I believe I did. That's <laughs> that's fantastic. Well, let's see. Um Let's discover a minion. Feld Cannon could be useful. I don't have a lot of creatures. Yeah, actually, Feld Cannon seems okay here. At the end of your turn, okay. You know what? Let's uh, let's lay this down and then destroy this. No, we have to destroy this guy, otherwise. He'll still be alive and it might destroy the Scarab instead. Or do we want to take the gamble? No, we don't because, yeah, okay. We'll kill that. We'll discover a four cost card. Void call. N wait. Mm. Yeah, let's take Void Caller. Alright, we'll leave it there. Ugh! I only just now realized that this basically means... You know what? I'm really glad he did that. Probably didn't need Big Game Hunter by the looks of it. Let's see what spell we get. Let's take Shadow Bolt so that we can just, uh, right on there. And then we'll put this down, which will take damage from the Fell Cannon, but uh, we'll get an imp for it. And I gotta, I gotta play something. I gotta empty my hand a little bit. It's scaring me how long this has gone on without me doing any considerable amount of damage to him. Wow. Couple of torches. Look at this guy. Imagine, explore the rod of the sun. I forgive me. I'm just gonna start talking over this guy. I'm getting kind of tired of this. Of this, to be honest. Probably should have discovered a spell first. Bane of Doom, definitely. All right, we're finally gaining an advantage, at least on the board, it's at least for now. <laughs> Alright, this is all super easy to deal with. Let's put you here, you here, here, and then Bane of Doom you. I can ease your pain. Not the card I most wanted from that, although we do have Demon Heart, so that could be that could be something. Definitely don't want Deathwing. Voidcaller's probably not going to do any good. Let's try Anubiseth Sentinel. And I can tap here, but I really don't think I want to. Cool. Not as cool. My hand is too far. Alright, we have 9 mana, which gives us just enough to implosion this, so we don't have to deal with it. Then we can Demon Heart you. <laughs> nope, nope, nope. Hold on. Almost made a 
terrible misplay there. <laughs> then we get rid of you. Then we go across. Gotta remember to do this earlier in the turn. Discover, that is. Hey, let's see what we can do on the map. Break that jar, I assume. Flip some coins. Oh, that's fun. Ah, Roaring Torch. God damn it. Alright, this got slightly problematic again. But, not a crisis. This guy helps a lot. Let's get rid of you. Um, we're probably going to end up playing this guy, but let's discover a spell first. I think Shadow Flame is our best bet here. It's given us that option a couple of times now. And yeah, you'll do nicely. Honestly, we got what we wanted out of Mistress of Pain. I'm not too upset at having lost her. Sure. Alright, healing up some more. My hand is too full. That's a bummer. Who do we get? Ooh, hello, my friend. I see. I like that a lot. Then why don't we? Dark bomb you. Kill you. Honestly, I need him to be alive more than I need damage, so let's do that. Alright, and then we've almost certainly got this wrapped up next turn. Yep. Yep. Is this a pirate? No. Huh. That might be better if it were a pirate. Well, it would objectively be better if it were a pirate, but... And, I don't know. Let's just be, uh, throw down Malagos for fun. Boom. Alright! Not a bad first one. Not too exciting. Uh, definitely had me a little on edge there at the beginning, but this is just kind of a late late game deck. Oh, Jin of the whenever you cast a spell, cast a... Huh. I really like those kinds of cards, uh, like Dragonkin Sorcerer, like whenever you target like a, you, something to give it a buff, you get another buff on top of it. Um, I like the idea. I feel like it hasn't been particularly well implemented so far. We've that could just be me, though. Vault. You handle the guard, I'll take care of the rest. Sun Raider Ferrix. First piece of the staff. Whoever controls the Rod of the Sun is immune. Oh, a passive. How do you control the Rod of the Sun, I wonder? Well, let's find out. Gul'dan versus Sun Raider Fair. Maybe Death Rattle at Trades Places. The Rod of the Sun I see it has a Death Rattle. That would be my best guess. Alright, let's keep Twilight Guardian and Antique Healbot. Big Game Hunter actually might not be a bad idea, just because we have no idea what creatures he's going to play, if he might get something out really powerful really early. But uh, this is just a, a great four drop in my opinion and uh then in case we're kind of up shit creek on turn five we can heal for a bunch this is definitely a slow deck i don't have a lot of stuff under four grab that staff yeah that's what i thought okay when the staff is gone it trades it dies it trades places and then you're immune why would you i mean i'm not complaining but, damn. Alright, this guy isn't giving me any cards, so I feel like I can tap again. Next turn might be Hellfire. Depends on... Oh, hey. 
What do you know about that? That's kind of unfortunate for the time being, but, uh, yeah. Oh, God, that's really unfortunate. Oh, come on! Alright, well, I need to antique heal bot pretty much. Turn six. Alright, this is interesting. Actually, no, it isn't. It's a pretty easy decision. And then next turn we can start defending the staff. Yeah, let's try this. Mine. You will burn. Oh, hey! Unintended side effect! I can now tap for free. Truth is my shield. Oh, I wish I had anything three cost to play. How could I play this? Yeah. Unfortunately, there's just no good way to use my mana this turn. I could play a 5 and a... You know what? We could Blackwing Corruptor the Divine Shield away, and then they would probably trade into the Corruptor, but then I'm not getting anything done either. Let's play this. Get rid of the Divine Shield here. Because I can't just let that live forever. Uh. Okay. Well, at least that lets us do this. I wield the power, Black. And then I have eight cards, so I can tap safely. Alright, we're gonna start, we're finally gonna start being able to do some crazy stuff here. You motherfucker. Uh-huh. Alright, well. Wait. No, we want Chill Maw. Yeah. I didn't want to play it earlier because I had the rod and it would uh it would do damage to it, but now we definitely want that help. Alright. We can work with this. Because now I just need to do this. I wield the power, Black. And then this. You might want to try to hang on to that rod. It's valuable. Yeah, I know. All right. Oh my God, you asshole! Bathe in flames. You are the biggest asshole. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, yeah, we can tap. Play a super strong break. And then get rid of this. I swear to God. What is this RNG? Good lord! This guy is a dick. I'm not sure who we're going to need to use Alex Straza on at this point. He's out of cards, finally. That's the good news. Um, 
let's see what we can do here. Well, we can definitely... Yeah, okay, you know what? This isn't that bad. This isn't that bad. Because we can put him here, finish him off, start taking this guy down a peg, throw out our, our taunt dragon... We could tap and play another Twilight Drake. Or I could heal this one before he gets a freaking third Flame Strike. Then I could play Imp Gang Boss too. Actually, do I want to heal? I kind of want to heal this instead. That's not very helpful in the aforementioned third Flame Strike scenario, but I'm not sure that he actually has one. Fan-freaking-tastic. We are finally in a position to do something here. Alright, we got 5 plus 7 is 12. Okay, so we can't kill him this turn with Alexstrasza. Let's put you here. We can get another super powerful Twilight Drake. Oh, well, there. Now we could have won. Oh, well. Yeah, I guess I want you to go in here. All right. My shield for Argus. Thank God. Of course. We got him, boys. I bring life. And for the last. Oh, thank goodness. That was... That one had me nervous as well. I guess it's better that these seem more difficult uh, than the previous. Let's see, maybe he has a spell similar or anything at the same cost. That's interesting. I don't remember seeing that one in the previews. This one, I... I don't know. I'm not, I'm, not a, I'm not pro enough to immediately think of what type of deck that would be useful in, but I'm sure there's something that that would help. Got the first piece. Now we got to get out of here before we get squished. Temple? I okay, I wondered because he said this guy had the rod, what the third match would be then. Encounter new obstacles. Okay, I'm actually kind of excited for this. But going going back again, um but I'm also not sure if that's just because I'm using my dragon lock deck to fight them now. Cuz that's a really the slow deck, so you know it does kind of have that couple trips up a little bit at the start maybe your soul shall be mine we go first um honestly let's keep all of those twilight drake is great because this deck as i just mentioned doesn't play a lot in the first Black couple turns it's easy to build a nice everywhere. hand size to get it blackwing corruptor is really handy to have and uh hey, of course antique heal bot in case you don't have time for that Nine turns to... Oh my goodness, what is this? This is so cool. This is so cool! Okay, it's about to be turn two for me. Gaining a mana crystal... I mean, yeah, that's, that's the obvious choice here, isn't it? Nine turns to escape. That makes me worried... He isn't he doesn't use cards, so it's literally just the minions he plays that I have to deal with. Hey, a bit of spikes. I see. Let's take five damage. Okay, we know we can heal it. Through the spikes. Will you hurry it up? Let's play one of these. That boulder's huge. Get out of the way. Whoa! Hello. What? 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 Holy crap! 
Alright, this is starting to suck a little bit more. Okay, we just have to survive. Hmm. This is the best way to ensure that we get to kill this guy next the power. Hmm. Let's make extra sure that we can kill this guy next turn instead of just leaving the turtle alive with one health. Okay, the rumbling's getting worse. I bet the whole ceiling collapses next turn. <laughs> hey, that's a nice statue. Oh, and such a shiny ruby. Oh dear. Draw two cards with Oh! Okay. So we get some more good stuff. This is crazy. Um Yeah, let's restore health. Uh-oh. He doesn't look happy. I think he wants his gem back! Wait, what? I didn't... Oh, God! Did it indicate somewhere? Like, obviously not... Did the card names... Oh, God. Uh, that was a mistake. That was a mistake. Holy crap. All right, well. Of course. This is literally the worst. All right, next turn. I didn't realize the rolling boulder stayed with us. I mean, of course it does, but. Hey, whoa, what is this? Glad I could get you out of the way. You're welcome. Good lord. Alright. He doesn't have anything to attack explicitly next turn, so let's just put some put some stuff on the board. You cannot be allowed to escape. Just a 510? I can live with that. Okay, now, we can kill this thing this turn. Wait. Yeah. Yes, we can. My shield! I really shouldn't have tapped there. I keep forgetting I'm not actually trying to kill him. I just need to survive. Sure this will get us out faster. Let's go! On my map, it just says, don't go here. This is so cool. This is so cool how they're doing this, guys. I am kind of geeking out. One turn closer, but we have to deal with a golem. Oh, man. I... I don't know. Chillmaw would certainly be incredibly helpful in terms of uh, getting rid of it. But then we can't heal bot. In fact, we can't do much else. Let's do nothing. We can build up a good board this turn.
wait. Hmm. Yeah, let's do it this way. So that we can save the taunt for when he actually has things to attack next turn. Because right now, we don't know. The next trap could kill everything on the board again. Phew. It's getting hot. We need to hurry. Zero nine. Okay. Unfortunate. But, uh, fine. Oh, Alex. My hero. Yeah, now I'm really glad we didn't deal with that golem. Hey, look at me. Look at what I can do. Boom, boom. Get rid of you. And... Yeah, that's all. Good measure. Bugs. Two ten threes. Oh, that's it. Fine. Running a program. Hug. Hug I'm really nervous now. What's this last turn gonna be? Let's not tap just in case. I'm scared. Almost there. I can see the sun. Oh, okay. Fantastic. Wow. Oh man, that was really cool, guys. <laughs> oh, I never thought I'd be happy to see this desert. Desert. Oh, I think I need water. Rumbling elemental. No overload, that's good. Four two. So it stays on the board and it deals that could be useful. Hmm. I saw someone online talking about how this would be effectively useless, but it it sounds good. I mean I understand that it's not the most common to keep playing minions to, you know, like, fill the board with a bunch of minions. And, uh... I don't know, we'll see. Class so hey! Thank goodness! The, uh, Warlock class challenge is in the first week. Also, that dude was creepy. So, it looks like we've got... It said there were three parts to the staff, I want to say. It looks like we got the bottom half, then there's going to be this part, and then probably the orb on top, and then... Like, what? The fourth wing is going to be fighting museum curators or something? I don't know. I'm curious to see. Let's do some class challenges. Let's see. Oh, that was an actual card! That's a... Uh... I mean, it's basically hogger, but susceptible to BGH. More expensive. I don't know. The stats are nice. Plus, it generates the taunt to kind of... Huh. That could be useful. The only thing is, the scarabs are 1-1s, one and warriors generally like to use whirlwind effects, so I'm not sure how that would work. Um, see, I don't know, if I draw a fiery war axe turn two, this could be nice, but let's save him for when we have some weapons. These are, I mean, tournament attendees, not good at all, but... <laughs> King's Defender. Well, I guess we'll hope tournament attendee lasts until turn three. Kinda doubt it, though. Yeah. That makes sense. Give your taunt minions plus two plus... See, that would actually combo really well in the King's Defender right here, except that this Pit Snake, this pit snake is going to kill it no matter what. <laughs> well, hi there, Dr. Boo. Nice to see you. Up. 
Oh, come on! Well, you're just a dick. You know that? Now I'm one mana short of... Not seeing a lot of death rattles. And Death's Bite is really freaking good against this stuff. Okay, well, I guess I don't care about the extra durability. I just don't want this snake around. Getting some pretty good draws on these wishes. Oh, this is lovely. This is quite lovely. Um, I guess Iron Juggernaut? Unless, do we want my Exna? I mean, if he throws down a third Pit Snake, it's just gonna die to that. I don't know if Iron Juggernaut's gonna have time to be helpful, though. I mean, we are playing Warrior. Yeah, let's go with Iron Juggernaut. But now we get to do the fun stuff, because we get to do Blood this, and this, and this. Woo! And I guess I'm gonna save that last charge of that weapon. Then. Makes sense. Trade the wisp into it, though. Or do that. Okay. Let's see what minion we get. Inspire. Summon a 1 1 Silver Hand Recruit. Hmm. Silver Hand Recruit could help us, but uh, I think this is where we want to go. Here. Alright, so I can attack here. Attack here. Throw down this guy. I. Because it can be played for zero mana, and there's some stuff that wants me to have a taunt or something, I think I'm gonna hold on to him and not just throw it down there. Okay. Okay. Alrighty then. Turn six. Now things really start opening up to us. Let's... You enjoy that. Oh, I should have discovered the minion first. Um, hmm. I'm not really going to have a chance to activate this. Yeti could be nice. I mean, Hogger, though. That's just... Is he, he's fun. He was the fun pick. You could argue that the Yeti was the better pick there, I think, but Hogger's more fun. Mortal Strike is probably going to be the most important one to have here. And what's better than a turn 7 Dr. Boom? Don't want him to keep that. Or that. He'll have plenty of time to deal damage here in the near future. Plus, if this really drags on too long, he'll just draw that mine. My friend, you're making it too easy. That could have been funny. Ah, boo. Alright, it would be really great to play two cards this turn. So... 
Sunwalker and Bolster. Oh, I could have played Target Dummy with that too. That would have been nice. Oh, well. this shouldn't last too much longer. Unless he's got a crazy board clear here. Does not appear so. My eyes are open. Fantastic. Alright, that was fun. That's a fun little deck. A lot of taunts and then you know, bolster. That was fun. And it gets us this, of course, which, uh, I don't know. I don't play a lot of Warrior. I don't know how good that is. This, uh, I'm so underwhelmed by this. The, uh, the Reliquary, the, the thing, I think it gains plus four, plus four if you have at least three other minions. I don't know. That, that's, that's a difficult condition to fulfill. But it's otherwise a 1-1 one, one for 1, which, you know, th there are a lot better things to play on turn 1, but it's flexible, you know, in that you could play it. At any rate, that one, though, is just, uh... 2 mana... I mean, you're getting value, because it's giving you a card. I still... I still don't think it's terribly good, though. Ancient Shade... It, I don't know. We'll we'll try it out. We'll see what happens. Wrath guard. Oh, this could get ugly quick. Oh my god, does this deck this deck wants me to kill myself? Alright, well, curse isn't gonna do anything while he has this majigger up, so there's no point in playing that now. Hmm. Yeah, I guess let's see what happens here. This could go a number of different ways. I protect <clears throat> the temple. Really? Interesting. Very interesting. Okay, so now... I want to kill this, and then kill this. That's, that's really good. That's a great opportunity, but then what do we do about you? See, if we play this, you could just play one spell, and then attack into it. And that's that's pretty much that with the with the pyromancer. So I say let's curse him. Yeah, yeah, okay. Feel my pain. Now we can do this, and then this, and then this. We don't get punished at all. Okay. Hmm. Is that a cigar in it? Oh no, it's a guy's leg. Ha! That's that's pretty funny art. I'm down with that. Um, let's see. I mean, don't I pretty much have to play this at this point? Ancient curse. Let's see how this works. I 
I think I want to, yeah, I think I want to do that so that it kills itself if he tries to, uh, yeah, do anything. Damn it. could potentially take a lot of damage for this. But I honestly think it's my best Feel answer right my now. Pain. Man, he is not getting rid of that curse. Which I am fine with. Is my shield. Son of a bitch. That's problematic. Oh my god, I need to discover some kind of damage. My goodness. Beautiful son of a bitch. Feel my I really like the idea of this curse card. I am interested to play around with that one. Oh, you are the worst. You are the freaking worst. I don't I don't have any cards anymore either. Like and I don't want to tap. I don't want to keep drawing. I mean, I kind of have to. Pit lo oh, come on. You can't expect me to do anything good with that. This is abysmal. Well, yeah, of course he doesn't give a shit. It's getting hot in here. I mean, okay, I see. You're supposed to get this and then do all the stuff that damages... Well, hey, as a matter of fact... I don't know, this has potential. If he doesn't kill me. If he doesn't kill me, I could still win this on the next turn. Maybe. But see, now if I draw... I mean, that sucks. If I draw one of those curses, I'm done. If I don't, I can win. Okay. Okay. Oh my god, I'm one off. I'm one off. That son of a bitch. Basically, I need to tap into damage. Of any kind. You mother fudger. Can I do anything with this? Maybe. Released. 
kill this. Put both of these into here. Play Hit Lord. And pray. Well, fuck me. Wait, the idiot! The idiot! Yes! <laughs> he didn't use the flame lance on the rod of the sun. <laughs> ah! Oh, good job, AI. Good job. Good job. Dark peddler. I mean, to be fair, the mortal coil he gave me saved my ass completely. But, uh, I, <laughs> I still can't say I'm particularly, I have particularly high hopes for the card in general. Uh, oh man, okay, well that was fun. Um, at any rate, uh, that'll do it for Wing 1 of the League of Explorers Hearthstone Adventure expansion. Uh, I'm, I'm excited to see the rest of it now. I, I hope that the next uh, three wings continue to be as interesting um, as that last uh, as that last fight on the uh, in the first wing here. That, that temple was that was super duper cool. And uh, yeah, get some more cards. I'm excited to play with those. Yeah. Anyway, uh, that'll do it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please consider hitting the like button. Definitely leave me a comment letting me know what you think and anything you would uh, like to see in the future. And uh, that's going to be it for me today. Uh, hope you all have a good one. Thanks again for stopping by. I will see you next time.